Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to introduce you to Cloud AI and the reason behind this is because initially this API or this particular platform was available in just few countries UK US, but now it is available in widely lot many countries and that is free to use. So if you're not sure what this Claudia is, it is a large language model designed to comprehend and generate human like text, similar to how our, our other LLMs are working. So it can help you in your creative writing. It can summarize the text, write essays for you and even answer the questions from your input documents. So like any other LLM, it also works on the con uh, concept of context length, context window, which means that whatever you are asking, uh, specifically in the terms of documents it will give you the answer only within the context and that's what this LLM and the cloud AI is all about so and the special thing about this is it supports nearly 100,000 tokens which is quite massive as compared to other LLMs and this LLM has been trained and fine-tuned using reinforcement learning with human feedback which means that you can assign roles like human assistant and then go ahead and chat with the system. So let's understand more about this. So what all things Claude can do for us. So the very first thing it can help us in writing uh, create a writings for us in different formats, different styles. It can draft anything for uh, us, starting from a text message to an email, or if you want to make it uh, write a novel or screenplay or anything. Even you can ask uh, Claude to how to prepare any particular recipe or how can you learn Python. So it's completely like it will get the information, get the details and display it to you. It can even summarize the text for you and it is very, very, it will provide you very concise summaries of your long articles, stories, documents, conversations and even books. And when it comes to coding, it can be your very helpful pair programmer. So just give it a try and see how it works best for you. Another thing is it can also help in translating your text. So it is it works very well at English because because of its trained data, but it also knows dozens of other languages and can translate them on varying degree of success. So some languages Claude is specifically good at as English, Portuguese, French and German. But definitely you can try other languages as well. Now thing is, if we have so many LLMs around us, why should we go for this cloud? What is special in this particular uh, AI LLM? So the reason why uh, this is more popular is because of its use context length. If you will see uh, right now, we have like 4,000 token length or some LLMs with 60,000 and even 32,000. But this particular cloud uh, LLM is supporting 100 thousand token which is far beyond any other llm is supporting and it supports like various kinds of files pdf blog csv text rtf epub odp and the reason why you should use this is definitely it is good in chat but uh, it is very very good when you want to get answers from your documents because the best thing is his its context length and you can upload it has a limit of around it you can upload around 10 MB of files and max 5 files you, it will support and of course you have to be in its token limit which is uh, close to 100,000 and if you're working with a very large document then the recommendation is to divide your documents into smaller sections and then go ahead and use it but I would say it is absolutely fantastic when you want to get answers from your uh, long ebooks or long uh, quote related documents or legal documents or a policy related document just give it a try and i'm sure you will start loving it another thing is how to use it so there are various ways you can use this the first one and the most easiest to try this out is using the chat and that you can do it by going to cloud.ai another thing is it has like for app for the slack as well and for developers who really want to use this and experiment with it, they have the API available. But right now it is in closed beta, but I'm sure it will soon be out. And then other big news, like I said, initially it was available in just handful of countries, but now it is supported in like 
I can quickly show you. It is supported like almost more than 90 different locations. So it was updated a week ago, like I said, it's just updated. And most of these countries are in this, if you will figure out, you can just go to this link support.anthropic.com and search for where can I access Cloud AI. And these are the countries where you can uh, freely use this particular app. Moving further, uh, let's see uh, how we can get started. So this is the getting started guide here. And these are the various links which you can definitely explore it. These are the links for Claude AI as well as API and it will give you the instruction about how you can write prompt, how you can design prompt, what are the very well known use cases and how can you troubleshoot few of these things. So I would recommend you to just go ahead and check this out and coming on to the AI chat, the chat part of it. So you just need to go to Claude AI, Claude.ai and register to yourself by using any of the email ID and you will get access within just few seconds so once it is done this is a simple interface you will see on the web browser here you can type in your question even you can uh, upload your documents so here you can see it is saying you can add files uh, like five max five files you can add with each of not uh, size not more than 10 MB so make sure that you are within this limit and I can quickly upload one file and show you how it works so I'm just taking a small file for experiment purpose, but you can definitely take a large one and give it a try. And let me ask you, uh, let me ask a question. What this file is all about? Let's see what it has for us. Okay, now on the top, you can see that it has given a pretty nice title based on the content. And this is what this file is about. So this file was having information about uh, homelessness, the reason behind this and how is poverty contributing to this. So this is how nicely it has given us the answer of our question. And if you want to uh, delete this chat, definitely you can go ahead and delete it. If you want, you can rename it. If I will go ahead and delete it, it will take me back to the home page, which is like this. So I hope you enjoyed uh, this Claude AI and do experiment with it and let me know in comments what all things you are able to do with this. Thanks for watching.